The overall success of the football program really led us to the uh, notion of expanding Dowdy Ficklin Stadium. Uh, demand for tickets grew each year, obviously culminating in two uh, Conference USA football championships and hosting the Conference USA uh, championship game here. We basically were able to, out of a 43,000 capacity stadium, uh, we had about 22,000 tickets that we had and were able to, to work with uh, for Pirate Club members, for faculty and staff, and, and obviously we, we sold some to the general public also. And then you add the, the, the demand uh, that the students had, uh, and so it quickly added up that we needed more seats in Dowdy Ficklin Stadium. We will actually move the students out of section 16, 17, and 18 on the north side into the new east end zone area. Uh, we're going to work really hard with our uh, multimedia rights holder, ISP, to really do some fun and innovative things for the students in that end zone to help us create a terrific atmosphere. We're going to be able to uh, improve our game day experience for the, the Pirate Club uh, season ticket holders who actually will move into 16, 17, and 18, and a, another project that we're excited about, over 10,200 chair back seats on both sides of the stadium. We actually are going to be adding two scoreboard uh, uh, locations in Dowdy Ficklin Stadium, one obviously over the new East End Zone project. Then its entirety will be 88 feet wide and, and a little over 28 feet tall. The LED board it's, itself will be uh, 84 feet wide. Fans, regardless of uh, their seating location in Dowdy Ficklin Stadium, are going to have access to, again, current uh, game situation information down in distance time. And along with replay capabilities and certainly the other marketing opportunities and fun things that we'll do uh, on the scoreboards during the 2010 season. Progress on the uh, east end zone here in Dowdy Ficklin Stadium is on schedule. So we've got our fingers crossed. Hopefully the weather will stay good and uh, everything will be delivered on time.